Alrighty, greetings and salutations, my good friends. Let's go ahead and get started with today's daily challenge. I did real good on the last one. Oh, Marcel had a field day with this, I'll bet. This is Mongolia. This is Mongolia straight up. Um, hmm. The thing is, I'm not super familiar with Mongolia, so I can't tell you where we are. Mongolia is really big. So I'm just going to say somewhere out in this direction. Nope, way further over. Cool. 2,000 points. Sick. This looks like the United States. Um, in fact, I would be surprised if it wasn't. Yeah, this totally looks like the U.S. or Canada, I suppose it could be. It's definitely North America. Railroad crossing, yeah, man. Ooh, another big country. U.S. is rather large. Let's go this way. Seems to be more over here. There's a water tower, so we can might be able to figure out where we are. It's a state that doesn't use front plates. They do have white. Oh, that's Tennessee. Oh. Is this because it's the only 10 I see? All right. Um, so in Tennessee, if we could see this water tower. Oh yeah, definitely US. A lot of US just kind of looks bland like this, which is really sick. We love that for it. We love that for all the citizens of the United States of America. A um, lot of times in the US, water towers have the names of the little towns or cities on them, but this one appears to be blank. But thankfully, Tennessee is not very large. Um, so I'm just gonna say somewhere in Tennessee. Just go with, ooh, I don't know. Um, say like over here somewhere. Oh, it was a little bit further down near, uh, was that Georgia? No, Alabama. All right, not bad. Um, glad I was able to narrow it down to Tennessee. Hello. Uh, this looks like Europe to me. Uh, let's go this way. Let's go towards the town. That seems like the most logical way to go. Um, okay. Let's take a look at these signs. Whoa, 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 hold on. Sakonix something. Can't read it. Wait, Sakonix de RV. Uh, is that French? Could be French. Could be en français. <laughs> I'm saying. Well, yeah. Yeah, that could be French. I can see that being French. This is either France or Belgium. Those are the only two countries, at least that I know of, that speak uh, speak French. Attention, au enfants. I have something on my lip, like I put on some chapstick, some uh, lip balm, because uh, my lips have been so dry lately. We have where I'm living is just having a lot of weird weather stuff, so. Uh, a lot of... Yeah, man, this is definitely... I don't think this is Belgium. I think it's France somewhere. Problem is, France is pretty big. Um, but we've been having some weird uh, weather stuff lately, so... My lips are just very chapped. And I put on some chapstick, because... What better for chapped lips than chapstick? And, um... And, uh, it, you know how it kind of, like, balls up sometimes? Even if it's, like, moist, moisturizing your lips, it's still kind of... You get those little balls of, like, dry skin or whatever. And I had one, and I was just, like, you know, trying to blow it off. Which is really fun. Fun pastime. Um, FreedomEuropa.com. That doesn't help. Boy, I don't know. I, don't, I mean, we're obviously in France somewhere. I just... I don't think we're... I don't think we're near Paris. Um, cause a lot, a lot of times in like, regular, like just world map, they'll throw you near Paris, but, uh, I don't really have an idea of where we are. Yeah, I mean, that's the French flag. Romani, I don't know what that means. Um, is that Roma R Romania? Uh, I don't think we're in Romania. I guess we could be, but that'd be weird. Um, let's say we're in France somewhere. I don't know. Oh, we were in... What is this? Is this France? Schweiz. Is this Switzerland? Oh, we were in... Switzerland. Really? Oh, that's weird. Geneva. Huh. The outskirts of Geneva, Switzerland. I didn't know they used French, Fran French in Switzerland, but thankfully I guess fairly close, so that's not that bad. 
Um, I did not know this, they know they used French in Switzerland. This seems like South America to me. South America or Africa? No, this is South America. In fact, I would be, I would be pretty comfortable saying that this is um, Colombia. What did I say? Provincial something. Inicia area natural protegida. Protegida. Prote yep, that's what I've been saying this whole time. Some sort of nature reserve in Colombia. I mean, look at these hills, and look at the, like look at all this, all this greenery. If this isn't Colombia, then it's got to be another country. <laughs> that's what that's what they say. That's what they all say. Uh, yeah, I could definitely be doing better right now. Oh wait, hold on. That is not a Colombian plate. That is not a Colombia plate. Um, and it's not a not an Argentina plate. Hmm. Maybe Peru, or... Where's the sun at? Sun is, like, right here. That... Too high in the sky to tell. Sick. Um, yeah, this could be Peru. There are some places in Peru that are super green. I could see this being Peru as well. I, I just don't think it's lower down. I, it could be Brazil, I suppose, but... I don't know, man. I'm not... I'm not super familiar with all of Brazil, because it's a very large country. So I can't say for sure unless I see one of those Portuguese C's with the little curly Q on the bottom. Um, unless we see another car, I'm probably going to guess Peru near or near near Colombia. Because I be believe they do border each other. In fact, let me just... Oh, wait, no, yeah, yeah, they do. Ooh, well, uh, not well, though. Not much. Hold on, natural. What did that say at the beginning? Did I go this way? Which way did I go? I think it went this way. What did that natural park thing say? It said... Natural... Po pro po di natural... Po protegida. Natural protegida. Maybe I should have been looking around for that. I don't think it's in Colombia. Okay. Is it somewhere in Peru? Natural. Um. Hmm. Ooh, I'm gonna feel real silly when I when I find it. Is it Ecuador? Wait, no, that's Ecuador. Oh, I wanted to choose Peru. Eh, that's fine. I'll leave it in Ecuador. I don't see natural protegida. Uh. I don't know where it is. We'll find out. That was in Mexico. Oh, jeez. I don't even see natural protegida. Oh, God. Oh, God. Well, it wouldn't have mattered where I chose in South America, because I was totally wrong. It wasn't even South America at all. It was North America. Um, this is a Cyrillic-speaking country that is... No visible sky rifts. Um, hopefully it's not Russia. It doesn't look like Russia, though, to be honest. It kind of looks like, um, Serbia. Could be Ukraine as well. But let's... Let's keep looking. I don't know if Serbia is part of the EU. Uh... Can I even go this way? Is there gonna be anything? Or am I just going further into... Am I descending further into madness? Oh, wow. There's no way I'm going to get good today. Uh, I think the most I can get is, uh... The best I can get is 17. That is pretty rough, to be honest. Um, but man, that Mexico one... Oh, we're in Ukraine. Oh, ooh. That's... I mean, Ukraine's not small, but it's not huge. Um, which is helpful, I guess. But it's kind of not helpful either, because, um... It's kind of a big country. It's not Russia big, but it's definitely bigger than I wanted it to be. I'm not sure if I will be able to pinpoint where exactly in Ukraine we are. What do these signs say up here? Are they, uh, cities or anything? I'm sure that says something. Oh, let's 
let's say we're over here. Nope, other side of the country, sick. That's what, 15? 16 barely? Yikes, that's rough. That is really rough. Yeah, problem is, like, they stuck us in a bunch of big countries. Well, Mexi the Mexico one, I don't even want to talk about that. But Mongolia, I don't know Mongolia, it's huge. And Ukraine is pretty, pretty large, and I don't know Ukraine very well. So that was a bad game, uh, believe it or not. Um, that's it for me today. Farewell. Salutations.